The number one team in two-way, the Glenrock Herders, hit the road for Burns on Friday. Glenrock took the game over in the first quarter, putting 19 points on the board. Garrett Swint had two touchdown runs of five and seven yards. Cooper Fargen also scored from a yard out. In the second quarter, Burns got on the board thanks to a touchdown from the doorstep from Clayton Clark. Glenrock answered with a score of their own as Fargen with the second TD of the game, this time a 47-yard run to the end zone. So at halftime, Glenrock led 27 the six. In the third quarter, Fargen scored for the third time going in from 15 yards out. Burns, in turn, answered with a TD pass from Clayton Clark to Austin Zettler. But as soon as the Bronx got some momentum, Glenrock stole it right back as Swint went off for 35 yards and a TD in that third quarter. Swint added a 51-yard run for a score and finished the night with 260 yards rushing on 22 carries. Fargen had 143 yards on the ground on 11 carries, and that is the way the Herders have beaten teams this season. The final, Glenrock 49 and Burns 14. Glenrock remains undefeated at 6-0, clinching a number one seed in the playoffs. The Herders travel to Lyman this week. Burns will sit at 2-4 and four and they will host Wheatland on Friday.